This time on Science for Humans, fake bacteria fart when they get hot. I'm not kidding. This is, this is really science here. So climate change is lots of gases like CO2 and methane and nitrous oxide and a couple of others that I didn't write down that are increasing in quantity in the atmosphere. So we have more of them up there. And this keeps heat in. Now it works like this. I'm a heat wave and I came from the sun, went all the way to earth and I hit the top of the speeding black Porsche and I bounced all the way up in the atmosphere and I'm like, sweet, I'm gonna get out of here. And on my way up, I ran into a methane molecule. The methane's all like, no, you aren't, get back down there. And I'm like, oh. This is how methane blocks some of the heat that's trying to leave the earth and on the whole makes things a little bit warmer. Now, methane is four times more effective than CO2 at knocking heat back down. And one of the big questions in climate change right now is how does all this extra methane get into the atmosphere? How's it getting up there? What's the cycle? How does it all work? Now, the answer is probably lots of ways. Big one is actually cow farts. We know that. But another one, it turns out, is bacteria in freshwater lakes. Now, like all living things, the bacteria that live in these lakes eat stuff, nom, 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 and they digest stuff, and they poop stuff, and they fart. Now, on the whole, bacteria in lakes fart a whole bunch of different things, like CO2 and methane and hydrogen sulfide, which really stinks. But what uh, Gabriel Yvonne Dorcher, which I think I just butchered your name, sorry, man, and Andrew P. Allen and a whole bunch of others found out is that bacteria on the whole in these lakes when they get hotter, they fart more methane. And specifically, they were able to figure out how much hotter. So if it's a degree hotter, they'll produce this many more methane molecules. Now, since climate change makes things hotter, and hotter makes more methane, and makes, methane makes it hotter, they have what's called a feedback loop. And that's not good. Now, don't worry, it's not infinite, and the Earth isn't going to boil away from farting bacteria. But what this study does is tell us how much more the freshwater lake bacteria are going to fart methane, and that helps us predict and plan for climate change. And it helps us account for one more piece of where all the methane comes in the big climate puzzle. So it turns out we really do care if those little guys get gassy, and that's not a lot of hot air. Thanks for watching Science for Humans. Please help us get better by doing two things real quick. One, hit that subscribe button down below. You'll get an email anytime new videos come out. And two, leave us a quick comment with one thing you liked and one thing you'd like to see us try differently. It really does help. Thanks again. Science! That's, that's my science song. Science, science song. Science. Do 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 designs for humans.